Main review. Main review. Meme review. YouTube's favorite show ever. Last week we hit trending. Thank you guys so much for all the support. Oh boy, do we have a lot of spicy memes for this week's meme review. Last week we reviewed petting dog meme. Haha, -ha, I'm petting a dog. And it's many predecessors. You guys posted some as well. You joined in on the meme. Hi doggy. Hey look, it's me. Zootopia meme or Zootopia pro-life meme or Zootopia I will survive another web comic meme. meme. Have you watched Zootopia? Me neither, but it was about a bunny and a fox and someone s said to themselves, "Hey, I'm going to I'm going to make my own version a comic of that store Disney story about the fox and the bunny uh, talking about complex relationship issues such as pregnancy and whether you should have an abortion or not." Now this meme got a lot of attention mainly for the fact of the absurd absurd absurdity absurd absurdity absurdity for for three different reasons number 1 zootopia number 2 a bunny and a fox fucking number 3 the extremely over exaggerated panels the emotions that the the artist really captured in this fan fiction is quite something so you can easily just replace the text with pretty much anything and it will just feel off. <laughs> I cannot live another day without air conditioning. It says tomorrow's gonna be hotter. Good meme. They both weigh the same, Nick. They are both a kilogram. But steel is heavier than feathers. It's actually true. I don't see how people struggle with this mind thought prog thing. Steel is heavier than feathers. Everyone knows that. Because it has this bigger density. You know, Traps are gay. Look, I posted this one. Look at that, everybody. I am funny and relevant. I post, I post relevant memes. Please validate me, please. We have the One Punch Man. We have the Silly Rabbit. Tricks are for kids. Everyone knows that. We have the everything that we know and love is reducible to the absurd acts of chemicals and there is therefore no intrinsic value in this material universe. Hypocrite that you are, for you to trust the chemicals in your brain to tell you they are chemicals. All knowledge is ultimately based on that which we cannot prove. Will you fight or will you perish like a dog? This of course is based on the Donald Duck meme and Mickey Mouse meme. Uh, but uh, it begs really the question, you know, people look at love as some sort of strange substance that we can't understand when really you can just break it down in scientific uh, thing. You know what they say, love is blind. I don't understand. <laughs> this is, this one is probably my favorite. I don't understand. Our family, our entire clan. Why did you kill our parents? To measure my abilities. Good old Naruto meme. It's over Anakin. I have the high ground. You underestimate my power. Nick subs, not dubs. No, I can't believe you said that. Nick, hear me out. <laughs> really, the, the, the numerous amount of, of comic strips that can be adapted in, in, in this comic, I think is what really makes it so successful. Hey, how do you sprint? Alt F4, player Nick has left the game disconnected by user. You know I had to do it to him. <laughs> so dumb. Hey look, it's the last meme everybody. That's how you truly know if a meme has been accepted or not. Does it have a lost meme? Then it's not a, tr a true meme. We have of course petting dog meme. Fans of this comic notice himself that in the very first image, the building is the same building as the Seinfeld building. This begs the question. Was the artist memeing all along? It's a very interesting topic. No! Yeah. I will have to rate it not too high. It was amusing for a while, but I think I think the adaptation so far that I've seen doesn't really live up to the potential of this meme. I mean, look, look at these facial expressions. Subs, not dubs. Can we talk about more important issues? 
such as PewDiePie doesn't make original content. Uh, so I'm gonna give it a 4.5. I think it can grow to a 5.5 if we see some better adaptations in the future and not this subgenre of memes like you know i had to do it to him or moss you know and petting dog the meme has so much potential that it doesn't really need to rely on other memes or crossover memes to live up to it i think with with clever adaptations made by the community we can really lift this meme up and make it stronger together as a collective Moving on to the next meme. This is my favorite meme of the week, which of course is the Doki Doki Literature Club memes. If you haven't played Doki Doki, click away now. Not because I don't want to spoil Doki Doki to you, but because Doki Doki Literature Club memes is something that you have to work for, okay? It's a normie proof meme. It's protected from normies because you have to sit through literally two hours of dialogue just to get to the scary part. The people that can laugh at the Doki Doki memes are the people that worked hard for the Doki Doki memes. We've, We've earned, earned these, these memes. memes, okay? We worked for them. And really, that's what all memes are, really. It's a, it's a secret club of haha inside jokes. Haha, <laughs> that's funny. I know where that originates from. I bet my mom doesn't. Haha, <laughs> this meme makes me laugh now. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> now Doki Doki of course was this, the, the game that looks cute on the outside, but on the inside it's the complete opposite. Uh, what I played, what I expected, what I've got. Can you save fictional characters? I gotta tell you, this is pretty terrific. Now, I think what's so great about Doki Doki memes is that each of the four characters, Natsuki, Sayori, Yuri, and Monica, they all have their own individual subset of memes within the Doki Doki memes. And, and, and all the subsets are based on their personalities and their, per and, their per and their personal events that happen in Doki Doki. We have Natsuki, which is a cute tiny little girl. I mean, look at that, she's adorable. Then you have Suki. To contrast this young, tiny little woman. I just want to say, for my own personal record, whoever made Buff Suki or, or Swole Suki, you need to die. You need to die and go to heaven straight away. It is god awful and I don't ever want to see it. The more I look at it, the more, the more life gets sucked out of it. I think it's a cursed image and I think whoever is making it sucks the life out of people in an attempt to live forever. Natsuki, square up thought. Uh, Natsuki, which also is the little edgy character, she's the, she's the tsundere of the group. Uh, we have her saying her classic, her classic line, Be careful or you might cut yourself on that edge! Moving on, we have Sayori, the main character of Doki Doki. The, the extremely cute and childish sort of character, which is really the pinnacle of this meme, you gotta say. When your childhood friend rejects your confession, guess I'll die. Sayori forces a smile through an incredibly pained uh, expression. And uh, another stock image meme of the I want to die smile face meme. Which makes sense, of course, because Sayori commits suicide. Monica, this is not a meme, this is just a picture from the game, but reading it after you finish the game, it becomes a meme. You kind of left her hanging this money, you know? <laughs> Here we have Sayori dabbing, petting dog meme. Here we have a PewDiePie crossover Sayori suicide meme. Uh, we have memes about happiness, goals, and generic content, which makes you laugh. Ironic memes and edgy memes, sad and crippling depression memes, everybody. Isn't that great? Photographer takes a picture of students before and after telling them, I love you. We have Yuri, which is cute, she's, she's timid. Monica gets happy. Uh, Natsuki, of course, is Natsuki. And Sayori, god damn it. Well, that's all the Christmas decorations up. Only one more thing to hang. She's so cute which really elevates this meme so much. Because of the Japanese influence that this actually Western game has, we have of course the Blend S version of this meme. <laughs> 
suicide. Then we have my girl, my bae. If you pick any other girl but Yuri, I'm sorry to say you are re That's not be me being offensive or hyperbolic. It's just straight up facts. Yuri is the number one girl, and if you don't realize that, then I have no other choice but to say there must be something wrong with you. Oh, look how cute. Manga is literature. Oh no, it's returned. <laughs> We have Yuri, which personal trait is the the fanatics of the knives. So we have, of course, the Mo meme. I gotta tell you, this is pretty terrific. <laughs> I don't know why this exists. I don't stop posting the fucking monkey haircut memes. This is my favorite meme out of probably all Doki Doki memes. Because we have the finger, we have the two finger, we have the pen, and <laughs> we have the knife. <laughs> it's a very subtle meme. It's a very subtle meme, and I think a lot of you probably think you know what the meme is, but you don't really unless you play Doki Doki. That's right, mom. You don't understand this meme. Go. Just click away from the video. This is not for you, mom. But last but not least, we have the Monica memes. Just Monica. And the Monica memes are probably the greatest. Let's have a little look. A little bit of Monica in my life. A little bit of Monica by my side. A little bit of Monica is all I need. A little bit of Monica is what I see. A little bit of Monica in the sun. A little bit of Monica all night long. Sayori is shit wife. <laughs> Just Monica. Well done. I, I wrote a blog post a while ago about why I f***ing hate video games. Because this is what it does, it appeals to like the male fantasy. And like how much time the designers probably put into like building that woman's body. This game is I'm sorry. Just Monica, just Monica. Now, there are so many Monica memes and in Sweden, uh, in Sweden we have a, a song, I, I mentioned it in my Doki Doki playthrough. Uh, it's probably one of the greatest songs ever written. It basically just goes, Hey Monica, hello, hey on you Monica. Hey Monica, hello on you Monica. Hey Monica, hello on you Monica. Over and over and over. This song makes Gucci Gang seems seem like a lyrical genius, okay? But the, this song is so fucking catchy. And since we have so many Monica memes, I just thought, we'll just put the Monica memes over this Hey Monica song, which should have been Just Monica. Just, just Monica. Monica. Hey, hey Monica, hey Monica, hey Monica. Hey Monica, hey Monica, hey Monica. Hey Monica, hey Monica. Hey Monica, hey Monica. Hey Monica, hey Monica. I'm gonna rate it a 7.5 explosion, please. The highest we've ever rated the Doki Doki me. I mean any meme so far. Uh, if anyone wants to make a website with a scoreboard where other people can vote as well, that would be great. Depression undertones, which always gives extra points because of its adaptability, because of its normie protection, uh, cu the cuteness contrast that it has, the multiple characters of this meme. It's a very strong, very strong meme. Last meme. It's the Death Stranding memes. Which I know what you're saying, Felix. That, that's really not much of a meme. And I, I agree 100%. Legendary game maker Kojima is making... Explosion. Finally, his own game without Konami. 
And uh, Sony basically just opened the floodgates uh, and said, hey, you know what? You can take how much money you want and do whatever the heck you want. And that has basically resulted in, in one of the weirdest videos I have ever seen. Uh, people try and break down what the heck they just saw in this trailer and what the game is about. And uh, it turns out not even the people working on the game uh, has any idea what the game is about. No, not, no one knows what the meme is about. Here you have the an animator saying, again, I thought he was kidding, but I soon realized that Kojima was serious. <laughs> Kojima, you are safe now, my sweet child. Whatever the hell that was, me, I owe you my life. The trailer has so much information on, in it, and there's just too much to break down. And we had a lot of questions on the previous trailer, but now we have even more questions. What in the world is happening? There's a party in my tummy! Why is Norman Reedus having a baby inside his belly? Is he going to give birth to Bebe? How did Bebe end up inside Norman? And which hole will Bebe come out of? These are the questions that fans are waiting for. And I think, I think this meme, the reason why I'm bringing up this meme is mainly due to the fact that get on board now. Okay, get on board on the memes now because this is just the beginning of what clearly is panned out to be even more beautiful memes in the future as we go further along. Now, I don't know about you, but I think the... The, the video is pretty straightforward, okay? You have these other world creatures that wants to kill the people, right? So they have the baby, and he, he's like, Oh shit, I've been discovered. He throws away the baby as soon as he realizes he's been dis discovered and tried to kill himself. But he fails. In the trailer, you can see people aging faster while being in this black gooey thingness or whatever. I think the baby is basically you moving your soul into the baby, which is why it's doing the thumbs up just like the guy did in the trailer before he died. And then the goo is used to age himself quicker. Does that make sense? Of course it does. Of course it does. This meme, I'm giving a three, but it has a long, uh, so much potential that this could be a 7.5 just like Doki Doki. So I'm urging you, get on board now. And that was it for this week of meme review. I want to thank all my family, all my friends, all my fans, and all my dogs. Thank you guys so much for another episode. Let's get this on trending. Meme review, everybody. Meme review. And the squad fam. Ah.